Alright, so the thing's obviously recording. Uh, I'm bored as shit, and it's 8.41 in the morning, and I'm just sitting here in my dorm room before I go to sleep after studying a lot, but I watched this video by the Needle Drop uh, about Burzum's Bellis album, and uh, while I do happen to think that you are a pretty good music critic, considering you did take on Velvet Cocoon, which is one of my favorite bands of all time, uh, I don't understand how you can be interested by Velvet Cocoon and then basically <laughs> shortchange Burzum for doing the exact same things as every other black metal band does uh, over, uh, what's the term I'm looking for here, uh, over mixing certain instruments over others really isn't something new to black metal. Uh, a lot of black metal bands do that, including Velvet Cocoon. Uh, if you take a look at Genevieve, the guitars dominate everything in the mix but usually when bands do this it's for a reason um, I understand that uh, it's a very heavily distorted album but really to say that Philosophum is less distorted than Bellus and worse and better produced I should say is uh, it's quite a stretch because actually Bellus is one of the best produced black metal albums I've ever heard in my life uh, the only other thing I really wanted to address in this uh, short little video response was the repetition thing. That's what black metal is really about. Uh, black metal doesn't usually really go places. Uh, a lot of black metal is extremely repetitive and it's due to the fact that uh, it creates atmosphere. I mean, if you're really going to get upset about how Burzum is repeating riffs for six minutes, five minutes, ha what have you, then I would really hate for you to have to listen to a band like Weakling or Wolves in the Throne Room where they repeat shit for 20 minutes ad nauseum. I, I mean, I personally just think you might want to give Bellis a few more listens to really appreciate what Varg is doing, because granted, while Varg hasn't done anything new with the album, he pretty much came back after a 16, 17 year hiatus and basically said this is how black metal is and that's why I think Bellis is as important as it is and musical opinions are always going to greatly differ which is uh, understandable but I figured I would at least throw in my input and hopefully you will uh, watch this video regardless of my staggering and my constant usage of uh but it's 8:43 in the morning now and I've been studying for who knows how long so take this as you will but I'm glad that you at least covered the album because black metal deserves more exposure. Uh, really, just take this as you will and keep doing what you do, man.